Hey guys, so I have a haul for you today, and it's a pretty large haul, so I'm going to jump right into it. First thing, I went on Sephora, and um, it's horrible going into Sephora or even doing it online. It's just, you can't not buy anything. But um, there's been some, something that I've been wanting for quite a long time, so I went ahead and got that. Um, first off, I got some samples, and I do like showing the samples because, you know, they're products that you wouldn't normally try, uh, or get to try, and if you guys want reviews, even on samples, I'll do that as well. Um, Urban Decay, there's an eyeshadow primer potion, and two eyeshadows, one in Sin and one in Mushroom. Um, this is Baja Oil Free Nightly Hydration. Let's see, this Fresh Umbrian Clay Mattifying Serum. And then the Daisy by Marc Jacobs Perfume Sample. I have a ton of these samples, I just keep them around. Um, this one smells really good. I like that a lot. Alright, so the first thing that I got was this um, Tarte Shining Stars Limited Edition Collection. And it looks like this. It has four items in it. But it comes with Tarte's Light Camera Lashes Mascara. Um, I've had this mascara before and I really like it. It's really defining and um, I, I really like that. Next thing in here is the Lip Surgeons Natural Limp Lip Tint. It says Enchanted on it. I don't know if there's a specific color. Um, I don't know if Enchanted is the color or what. But this is a pretty good size, and it's a pretty reddish color, but it's pretty sheer, and when it comes out, it looks a little, um, berry almost. There's that right there. So it's pretty nice. It's a nice little tint if you don't like too much color. Um, I don't generally wear too much color on my lips, so this is nice. Um, next thing on here is a full-size product, and it is their eyeliner. They're emphasized in black. Um, it looks... Oh my kitty! Fine. Get your camera time. Hmm. What's going on? <laughs> Alright. Um, it looks like this. The uh, packaging is pretty cute. And there's the eyeliner. I have not tried that yet. But I'm interested to try that. And then the last thing in here is their, um, what do they call this? The Natural Cheek Stain in Flush. So it's a little mini one. And let's see here. Have not opened this at all yet. Ooh, that's really, it looks really dark. But let's see. But it's totally not dark when you put it on. It almost looks very similar to the lip stain, but it's right here. And I used to just blend that out into your cheeks. It looks like a nice rosy finish, so that's nice. Um, so yeah, I thought that was a very good value for what you get in there. You get four, you get to try four Tarte products, so that's not bad at all. The thing I really went there for was this, and it's empty right now, but it is their one of their perfume sets. This one comes with four different ones, and they're like pretty generous sized samples. And then you get this, which has some stuff about the perfume, and then there's a card here. And it says scent certificate, which um, on the back here, there's little places to fill out. Um, you check which one that you like the best, and you go into a Sephora, and you get a full-size product of it. Um, so I've always wanted to try these samplers before, or uh, try them out, and I haven't before, so this was nice to be able to. And I'll show you these. This one's a Michael Kors. This one's um, Dior Addict. And they're cute little bottles. This one's Versace Yellow Diamond. And then Juicy Couture. So I'm not sure which one I like the best yet, but I'll keep you guys updated on that. And um, all of them smell pretty good. I'm pretty sure I'm going to go with the Dior Addict one. Uh, I think that's my favorite so far. I ordered from Bloom.com, and I had a code or, like, this gift card thing that... <coughs> there's this website called Embly, and it's basically, there's different things that you can send gifts to other people through Facebook, and it's like there's gift cards that you can send, like 5, 10, it depends on the company, 
Um, but there was one for Bloom.com. I think it was 10 or $15 that you could send someone. So me and my mom kind of like swapped that and like sent it to each other. And so I went to the website and I checked it out, see what I could get for like $15. And this is what I got. Let's see. First when I opened it up, it had this cute little um, sachet bag here. This little thing, that's cute. I didn't even see that in there. But it says, thank you for your order, and it says, welcome to Bloom. I got, I got this mini perfume, and it's called Lolita Limpica? I think that's what it's called. It comes in this cute little green box. And it's just a baby, and it looks like a little apple. It's so cute, though. It's just a little baby. Little baby perfume. How cute. So pretty. And, um, let's see. The only thing I do not like is that it's like this. You can't spray it or anything because it's so tiny. And it smells really familiar to me. I'm not sure. It's more fruity. Um, it's on the fruity side, so I do like that. I like fruity scents. But a nail polish. And I can't... I want to say that this was on sale or clearance out on their website or something, but it's by OPI, and it's this um, dark... Well, it looks darker on camera, but it's um, like a medium tone brown. And the color is Suzy Loves Cowboys from drugstore.com. They had a 40% off sale in all their um, on their makeup items, which I could have gone crazy on that when I first went on there. I had so many things in my cart, it was ridiculous. But then I clicked out of it, and then I went ahead and did another one. And, yeah. So this is what I got. Um, I got this Wet n Wild blush in Mellow Wine. And I'm, I'm wearing it today. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, it's a very pretty blush. Ooh. Looks like that. Um, it's pink, but it has some orangey tints to it, but I think it's really pretty, and it glow it goes on really smoothly. I really like how pigmented it is and how easily it is to apply it. And then I also got this from Wet n Wild, and it's one of the trios, and it is I'm Getting Sunburned. It is a pink, a, this one's really pretty, I don't know if you're going to be able to see it, but there we go. Um, it's a dark brown with some shimmer in it, some sparkle. And then the last one is a metallic orangish gold color. Um, I wore these two shades for Halloween and it's very pretty. Next I got these Swispers um, Professional Wedges. Just needed some other makeup applicators. There's only eight in here so I'm not, I don't really like that, but I only got them for like a dollar each since they were 40% off. And then, I've already used these, I just took them out of my shower, I got these, which is a shampoo and conditioner, it's Bedhead by TG, and it's the Urban Antidotes Recovery, um, damage level 2. Um, this is for your hair if it is dry, damaged, if you dye it a lot, if you use heat on it a lot, and you need moisture back in your hair, these are what you want to buy. Um, I have used it a couple times, but I will tell you that by the end of the day, it kind of weighs your hair down a little bit, but it has really affected my hair in a great way. Um, it has put moisture back in my hair. I have dyed my hair. I, I use a straightener and blow dryer on it, so it was pretty fried, and now it's like really nice and smooth. But I recommend only using this like once or twice a week because it, otherwise it will like leave your hair probably greasy if you use it too much. But I really like these and these were on sale on the site. They might still be, I'm not sure. But each of them were at around $10. One was 9 something one was 10 something My favorite hair care item of all time. And I guess they changed the packaging of it. But it's the Bedhead After Party. And the other one that I have, it looks like this. It just looked like that before. And now it has like this cartoon drawing on it. Oh, I love this stuff. You put it in your hair like after, you can put it in your hair before when it's damp, when it's wet, when it's dry, whatever. It leaves your hair so silky smooth. It's like ridiculous. And it looks so shiny. Oh, it's like, and I love the smell of it. It smells so good. And then I wasn't expecting like this stuff in here, but there was a couple like sample things in here. And this is the, this one's kind of funny. It's Sepical Sensations like warming them. Um, 
for throat pain. It's like a box of it. And I mean, that was, that was nice, especially because I was sick all last week. And then they gave you a sample of the Nivea Touch of Water Lily Shower Gel. So that was nice to add in there. Um, so yeah, I also had, um, when I talked about that Embly site, there was another one for beauty.com, which is basically the same site as the drugstore.com. They're one and the same, pretty much. So I had a um, code for that one, too. And I don't remember how much that one was. It was either 10 or 15. I think this one was 10. But um, I ended up getting an Urban Decay Primer Potion. And I, with shipping, I think I ended up paying like $13 for this, which is good because it's usually like $18, I believe, $20, I don't know. But um, I did not know that they changed the packaging on this, so it's really nice. It does not have the wand. It has this, where you just like squeeze it out, and I actually really like this. I got a Revlon Colorstay Foundation. Very good foundation. I'm sure everybody has heard of it before. And then I got the Revlon Photo Ready 3D Volume Mascara. And I like the packaging of this. It's like really sleek. And let me show you the wand here. The wand looks like that. Um, it's okay. The thing I like about it is that it's a separating mascara. Like it really separates my lashes. Like on this eye, near the end, I have a problem with them all like clinging together and it really separates it. And then I got this, which I'm really impressed by this. It's by Revlon. It's in their Color Stay collection. It's the Liquid Eye Pen. It's their eyeliner. And I'm... I've tried a lot of felt tip eyeliner pens, but this one almost takes the cake for me. Like, it's really nice and super black. It's like really black. The thing I really like about this is that it's not a hard felt tip pen. It bends. Like, let me see if I can show it. It like bends. So, I love that. I've been using that all the time, so like I used it today. I love it. Two things I'm going to show you. Sorry this video is so long, but the last couple of things. Um, first is this Essie Nail Polish in red. <laughs> I thought it had like a cooler name than that, but it's in red, I guess. Like there. There you go. And I did a swatch for you. That's just one. Ooh. That's just one. Um, coat on there. Um, I only got this for like $2 um, on an Amazon person, Amazon thing. Um, I will try to link the seller below. This nail polish by China Glaze and it's really pretty blue um, and it's called Want My Body. And I only got that for $3.29. I got that at Sally's. You can find a lot of um, clearance stuff there. I always check out their clearance because I always can find nail polish there. And that one is right there. I think that's a very pretty color. So that's everything that I got. Thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions about any of this stuff, please let me know in the comments below. And tell me what kind of videos you guys want to see because I want to do videos that um, you guys want to watch. So tell me your favorite kind of videos. Uh, thank you guys for watching. You guys have a great day. Bye!